right now, I'm walking um, over the saddle above Mistletoe Bay and now heading down toward the bay on the other side to continue paddling uh, to Havelock. I'll probably be down to the bottom of the bay in about two hours, it's about four miles, and then I'll throw the raft into the water and keep going. Okay, so it wasn't too bad of a hike, about five miles over the hill from Queen Charlotte Sound. I'm gonna inflate my pack raft, jump back in the water, and paddle onto Havelock to get there by the end of the day. Hopefully it's not too windy. The thing is, I created much of the route for this trip myself, and I wasn't aware of others who had tried carrying a boat from Mistletoe Bay to Mahau Sound to keep paddling. I had no idea if it would work. In Lord of the Rings, Frodo realizes after carrying the ring to Rivendell that he's more courageous than he ever knew. I will take the ring to Mordor. I felt my first real sense of accomplishment when I hit the water in Mahau Sound. An expedition idea that I had come up with just by looking at a map had actually worked, and I started to think that maybe other risky parts of my plan would work too. I've jumped into my pack raft, and now I'm gonna start paddling toward Havelock. It's a beautiful day out here. I mean, just look at this, it's incredible. So I'm here paddling, it's incredibly beautiful. I think it might even be better than Queen Charlotte Sound. Though I'm sure there's some New Zealanders that would disagree with me, but it, the water is so weird and green and just gorgeous. And uh, I'm a, probably about two thirds of the way to Havelock. Um, it's been pretty calm wind-wise today, which is a huge relief. Um, but uh, it's still a little bit choppy. I'm gonna try to get closer to the shore, see if that helps that, and then head on to Havelock. So it got a little windy out here, um, but the wind isn't going exactly against me. It's not a headwind, although it's not going quite in the right way I wanna go either. And I'm not an expert sailor or a sailor at all, but I've started discovering that if I use the pack raft pack as a sail and I orient it in the right way, I can kind of use the wind to my advantage to push the pack raft, pack raft to sail in the right direction. in Havelock, which is a smaller town than I expected, as you can see behind me, um, but it'll be really nice to end this stage, uh, relax, get some to eat, and then start hiking towards San Arnaud. Havelock uh, after four days of paddling through the Marlboro Sounds. Uh, I escaped the uh, terrible sandbar and the crazy windstorm and now I'm gonna get out of this raft and uh, get some relaxation time in before I start hiking. Today has just been by far the prettiest and most amazing day here paddling in the Marlboro Sounds. Just 
sailing along with the wind helping me out it was just fantastic. Wow, I just, I'm gonna remember this for a long time. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to see where I go next.